بہت کڑوی ہے میں اس ساکی کی رنگ لائے گی اگر سانسوں میں اتر آ دے تو بہت کڑوی بٹر ان ڈیٹ از اے مسٹیکل بوائن آف دس بلو الاؤ اٹ ٹو امبائی سرٹنلی اٹ ول ڈو سم تھنگ ماسٹر از کولڈ اے بلو دیٹ از کانسٹنٹلی بروئنگ سم تھنگ اے مسٹیکل بوائن دیٹ از نون ایز توجہ when the noor is absorbed and your energy is not engrossed in the realms of nafs instead it reaches to sulub the higher realms then at, out of that confluence something comes out pure you can call it light but that is tawajju the mystical wine and it begins to work at various realms within the seeker it balances the two sides of the brain that is why it is said that the meditation is supposed to be 45 minutes or up it takes nearly 45 minutes for this inner balancing of the two sides of the brain the left and the right to complete the process and that's where the tawajju comes but if the master is engrossed in his lower realms then the purity of tawajju or the wine that is being brewed will not be pure it is like a housewife who is preparing the meals for people she knows the proper blend of the spices of the ingredients she tastes it and with experience she does not need to taste anything because it is being prepared in a different environment this is how the master's tawajju comes he is not engrossed into nafs segregates the nafs the energy has moved from the lower centers and reached the kalp center that is why it is called the kalp zakir this heart center is in wo then profusely love flows and it when it merges with noor the light out of that tawajjuh flows and that is what brings about transformation in an individual بہت کڑوی ہے میں اس ساکی کی رنگ لائے گی اگر سانسوں میں اتر آنے دو الاؤ اٹ ٹو بی پارٹ آف یور بریتھ اٹ از سیڈ ون آف دی پرسن ہو ہیز ان ان دی مووی مرزا غالب مرزا غالب از اے پوئٹ از آف صوفی ریل ون آف ہز لائن سیز آتے ہیں مضامی غیب سے خیال میں دی تھوٹس دیس دی ٹرین آف تھوٹ کمس فرام عالم غیب فرام ان نون ریلم اینڈ اٹ ڈسینس ایٹ دا لیول آف تھوٹ کوشچن واز آسٹ وین وین یو آر ان ایکٹنگ ہاؤ ڈیڈ اٹ ہیپن ہی سیٹ اٹ واز دی وائس آف جگجیت سنگھ اینڈ آئی ٹرائی ٹو میچ مائی بریدنگ ود ہز بریدنگ so although i am doing the lip singing but yet still it must coincide with the breathing of the singer so when the seeker's breathing begins to match with that of master the seeker and the master becomes one with each other the two sides of the same coin and that is why matching the breathing where the breathing is comes in that's why sometimes we use zikr to match the breathing but it begins to happen naturally after a silent communion talk becomes necessary now it is a tahrir explanation what happens in meditation and at the moment when tawajju is flowing what had happened the temperature here is 
maintained or it is because in the beginning it was a little bit cold when we began the meditation session and slowly and slowly it became warm long time i used remembered during winter time when hazrat sheikh sufi onkar nath rasilla taala no started speaking on the savane hayat of various lakshbandi sheikhs the session will begin in the night around 9 o'clock and will finish in early hours the indian winter is of a totally a different kind the room where we had used to have session it was a small and windows are open the door is open the breeze is blowing the cold breeze everybody is tucked in their blanket but after maybe 15 minutes and so the whole place used to be full of warmth of a different kind but when the inner warmth comes in in the outer realm it gives comfort to the body also so in order to explain after the session of the meditation what happens tahreer or explanation is always deemed necessary buddha always sat in meditation with eyes half closed half open when your eyes are closed there is every possibility in the beginning that you may fall into a sleep although it will be slightly different more relaxing because if you have to sleep you cannot sleep while sitting down unless you are experienced that you can sleep when you have attained to that state you can take a rest in any state i can stand up and take a nap once it happened i had asked i was supposed to drop the car for some service so i told the driver to come and pick me up from that location so i had my briefcase and i saw a post so i just lean over it put my briefcase with me my legs so that it is supported and safe and had my eyes closed the person came and he searched for me and he went back and he didn't find me so when i called him he said i came i didn't see you i said i was standing by the post just i had a nap i said while i am waiting let me take a nap he said that's why i didn't see you so i said you were sleeping or i was sleeping if i was asleep you must see me because you are waking that's a different kind of waking so he kept his eyes half open half open means you are not open to the outer realm and half closed you are not op- closed open to the inner realms to the sleep so always eyes half closed half open so you are neither asleep nor awake but you are in between that state neither sleep nor awake and this is where the poet says jab dil ko neend aa jati hai aur ruh bhi kuch ghafil hoti hai phir main hi akela hota hu aur yaar ki mehfil hoti hai kal sahil walon se ro ro ye doobne wale kehte the jo mauj duba de toofan ko जो मौज डुबा दे तूफान को वो मौज ही साहिल होती है जब दिल को नींद आ जाती है वेन आईज आर हाफ ओपन हाफ क्लोज यू आर नीदर अ स्लीप नॉर अ वीक देन हार्ट इज एट रेस्ट और रूह भी कुछ गाफिल होती है द सोल इज ऑल्सो लिटिल बिट इंटॉक्सिकेटेड देन आई एम ऑल अलोन एंड देर इज द कंपनी ऑफ द mystical master kal sahil walon se ro ro those who have been have drowned in the ocean of bliss they were telling those those standing on the shore jo mauj duba de toofan ko that mysticism that energy field can drown any kind of storm that alone is sahil that alone is the shore the mystical shore this is one of the compositions zindagi ke samandar mein utha tha ek din lehron sa 
One day I rose in the ocean of life like one of the waves. This is the story of each one of us. On the ocean of life you come like a wave. जिंदगी के समंदर में उठा था एक दिन लहरों सा मित आज चला सागर की गहराई में टुडे आई एम ड्राउंड इन दी ओशन इन द इनर डेप्थ ऑफ द ओशन रह गई खामोशी सी हर मौज में नाउ देयर इज ट्रैंक्विलिटी इन एवरी विसिसिट्यूड एवरी टर्मोइल रह गई खामोशी सी हर मौज में तूफानों को जैसे साहिल मिल गया हर रह गुजर में it appears as if the storms the vicissitudes of life have formed the shore amidst all circumstances and situations this is the essence of meditation it is not that you come and meditate one hour or two hour its effect should be spread over your entire life and moment to moment when a situation comes how do i have to interact in that situation and that is why meditation becomes part of our life bahut kar di hai main is saaki ki rang laaye ki ghar saanson mein utar aane ki bitter indeed is the mystical wine of this brewer allow it to absorb in your breath certainly it will bring its own effect when you start drinking slowly and slowly the effect start coming on to you i have heard as someone said you know why the alcohol is not served in indian flights the person said i don't know he said five or six packs were served so there were diff- people of different ethnicity one was british after five drinks he said now i am going to take a sleep american said i am now going to work on internet german said, i am going to watch the movies chinese said i am going to listen to music and the indian said now i will fly plane so it has a different effects allow it to work within you it will be part of your life then you do not have to remember anything then every breath becomes the name of every breath becomes kalma you do not have to sing that you do not have to chant that because you are living in that awareness living in that light living in that noor first it has created some 